I'm Mahogany. And I'm Ryan. And today, we're going to be talking about living together. Mm-hmm. But it's the living together. No, it's not. It's, like, it's, nah, it's fun. Not, it's not fun, fun <laughs> at all. But we're going to give you five tips that are going to help you make it fun. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hopefully. Right? Hopefully, right? Hopefully. Now, before we begin, though, I just want you to know that this is not professional tips. These are our tips, and this is what has worked for us. Like we said before, what works for us may not work for you. Okay. All right, you ready? Yeah. All right, tip number one. Spend quality time together first. There's a difference between quality and quantity. Quality, you're getting to know your partner. You're understanding your partner. You are growing with your partner. Quantity, on the other hand, is spending time together every day, not understanding nothing, Going home, okay, I spent time with my babe. Next. No. Right. Make sure you take advantage of those opportunities. Mm-hmm. Movie nights, game nights. Mm-hmm. Uh, Going know, to the beach, taking a walk down yeah, the road. Shopping. Mm-hmm. All that good stuff. And half of the time, it doesn't require you to spend money, so. Right. I right. mean, you don't have to have quality time spent and spend money. Mm -hmm. That's something that a lot of people mistake for dates. You do not always have to spend money when you go out. You don't. Okay. Okay. All right. Tip number two, share the workload. Okay. That's a big one. Mm -hmm. I'm still working on that one myself, you know, because as a guy, I I tend to want to just take out the trash, you know? Yeah. And kind of... Uh, take out the trash that's it amount of work (laughs) but in all actuality I should be you know taking turns Mm -hmm. washing dishes and things like that but I have tried to do that but it's always an epic fail yeah so so yeah share the workload you know you'll learn whether or not you'll learn what your partner's strong suits are when you live together yeah You'll definitely learn it. Like, I know Ryan's strong suit isn't washing the dishes, Mm -hmm. so I can do it. Yeah, even in the dishwasher, I still, I don't know what's up with that. I don't know. So, yeah, that's tip number two. Share the workload. Never put more on your partner than you won't put on yourself. True. All right, tip number three. Big one. Create a budget. Create a budget create a budget all right it's real easy to just spend money you know like we said you know mm-hmm. going out and all this good stuff but you got to remember if you're living together especially if you're like a new couple on the block you might want to um save some money because <laughs> you got bills to pay. yeah especially yeah, rent yeah. electricity uh uh water y'all wi-fi phone bill car note car insurance y'all when i first moved in credit cards before i moved in with ryan Put money in mahogany pocket. I was just grocery. <laughs> I was Gas. so so babe. I'm just just kind of throwing just letting them know. I just, know. All right, babe. I know. Go ahead. So before I moved in with Ryan, I was so stuck in the thought of paying ties at church. <laughs> Go ahead, no more. I was so stuck in the thought of us living together. But it did not dawn on me the reality of bills until it became two of us and one home Mm -hmm. so you gotta think when you're living where you're living how much it's gonna take for you to pay your bills right all right but the main thing is just especially when it comes to grocery shopping write out everything that you need think Mm -hmm. about everything that you need prioritize and prior to, I can't even say it. Prioritize. I don't really care. To, all of your expenses. Prioritize all of your expenses on things that are the most important to the least important. And then if you have money left over, then you can spend money. Okay? Mm-hmm. That's the best way. All right, that way you're not a broke couple. You know? Yeah. Just living. All right. All right. Till number four. Talk it out. Talk it out with your partner. I cannot tell y'all how many times Ryan and I 
have gone through something and we decided we didn't want to talk about it but the reality is what is that song because guess what you sleep in the same bed so you mm -hmm. got to deal with each other anyway yeah i know yep she's still working on that she makes it sound so easy <laughs> she makes it sound so easy now but y'all like, it's hard it's, it's so hard especially when you want to separate yourself don't make fly away especially when you want to <laughs> boy <laughs> Go! Especially when we... What the world? <laughs> this is the thing trying to make me talk All right. Especially when you want to separate yourself from your partner. It's so hard. It's so hard to uh, do that when you live together. So just remember, when you live together, you want to talk everything out. Work everything out and um, think about how it would make your, your significant other feel. So... Yeah, what's the quote that you told me? If... It, if it's not going to matter, oh yeah, five it, years from now, mm -hmm. don't spend more than five minutes thinking about thinking it. About it. Mm -hmm. So That's keep true. that in mind, y'all. When you're going through something, really think about it. If y'all are arguing over who's making a bed at night or in the morning, don't let it drag out. Let it go. It's not it. Or if your or if your girl like try to throw shade on you. And you know you ain't gonna let her you know talk to you any kind of ways. Cause I do that a lot. You just gotta like, mm -hmm. you gotta swallow that pride, man. It's hard. It's real hard. It's it's hard. Yeah. So that's tip number four. Talk it out with your partner. Don't let it linger. It's pointless. Yeah. All right. And last final tip. Tip number five. <laughs> he gave me this one. Learn to like each other's interests. Y'all, I hate Call of Duty. I hate the Xbox. I hate all of that. But who bought him the Xbox? It don't matter. She bought something for me and I didn't want me to play it. I bought him the Xbox and I regret it. I could be doing a lot more. I could I could be doing a lot of the things out here. Y'all, I'm just kidding. Um, I just hate that Xbox because it it takes up time in the morning when I just want to cuddle. It doesn't really take up when time. I just, I just want to cuddle. I just want to watch It's called movie. leisure time. But he's Ladies, right. Please respect your your man's leisure time. All right. Mm -hmm. If he wants to take thirty minutes to play the game, let that man take thirty minutes to play the game. You know what I mean? He'll even take thirty minutes. In the house with you, that man could be going to hang with his with, his, with the homies and all kinds of other stuff. All he want to do is play Xbox. But y'all, that's 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 real though because that's something I had a conversation with my mom about because my mom is also engaged and she was telling me that. Mahogany, think about it. Would you want him playing Xbox at home, or would you want him out and about? Mm -hmm. And I, it, it's, it's real. Like you would prefer him at home, but it just drives me crazy. That's something then, that I just gotta get and over. And then I have to watch uh, all these reality TV shows every <laughs> single day of the week. So therefore, I'm learning to like that. It's, so you can learn to just, like. It's those just shows like an hour, an hour it's just long. Monday and every single show it's is like Monday an hour long. And, I'll, and, and I'm only playing the game for 30 minutes. And then I'm like telling people, hey, I got to go. Marty <laughs> said I got to get off the game. And I'm telling yeah, my friends that and it's embarrassing. It but I don't even, I don't be tripping about none of that. You feel me? Babe. But she can't learn to like 30 Babe. minutes of my Okay, y'all, he really game. does do that. Yeah, exactly. But I don't care because if they had girlfriends, they would understand. Anyways. Well, those are our five tips. I mean, obviously, mm -hmm. there's a lot of other things that we could have covered but that, that we didn't cover. Um, so, you know, if you can think of some things that we didn't cover and you would like to drop that in the comment section, please do so. Mm -hmm. um, also, we'd like to know if these tips help you in any fashion possible. So, um, yeah, yeah, and if you can relate to anything that we've said, whether that's playing the Xbox, I know. Let us know. I know y'all boys. Let us know. Matter of fact, drop yeah. a like if y'all can relate. So, yeah. Ladies. I know y'all can. Exactly. And if you haven't, um, check out our last video on how we met. Should be popping up somewhere like up here. Right there. So, and like always, please subscribe to our channel. And that's now you're it. rambling. Bye, y'all. Yeah.